I made this for you for your birthday. Oh! Because I knew it was your birthday, and I have a cooking vlog, and I dedicated the video to you, and the address is in here, and if you would watch it, that means so much to me. Absolutely. And you're so inspiring. Thank you very much. Cool. What is it? It's almond cookies. Cool! I hope you're not allergic to that. No, I'm not allergic to anything. <laughs> What? How old are you? I'm 12. Well, I'm 11 and like 3. <laughs> you can round out. Yes. Well, thank you. I appreciate it. Thanks so yeah, much. Nice so to meet much. Hi, I'm Livia Austin from the ABC Cafe, and today I'm making a really simple and easy treat in honor of Rachel Maddow. Rachel Maddow is an amazing political woman who makes learning about politics a lot of fun. She'll be speaking at in South Hadley tonight, and I'm going to go see her with my family. I'm really excited about this. And I looked online to see what her favorite food was, and I figured out that tomorrow is her birthday. So I'm going to be making some chocolate-covered almond macaroons. Let's begin. These chocolate-covered almond macaroons are composed of four ingredients. Almond paste, sugar, eggs, and chocolate. My first ingredient is almond paste. Almond paste comes like this when it comes out of the package. You can, it can either come in a can or a box like this. And it's a little bit firm as you can see. When I press down on it, it leaves a dent, but it's not very soft. So what you need to do before preparing this and mixing it with your sugar is you need to grate this. I have my seven ounces all grated and ready. And so you're gonna put your almond paste inside of a mixing bowl along with two-thirds of a cup of sugar. We're gonna mix this until it is like a crumbly dough. The third component to my almond macaroons is egg whites. And I get some beautiful eggs every week from my neighbor, Luca. He brings us eggs from his chickens. I've already cracked one of my eggs, so I'm gonna crack another. And I'm just going to separate the egg whites from the yolk. And this is what my crumble turned out to look like. This is the almond paste and sugar. And so what I'm going to do next is I'm going to mix the egg whites with the crumble. We're going to do this on medium speed until it is nicely incorporated and add the egg whites slowly. As you're going, make sure to scrape the bowl so it gets nicely incorporated and you don't miss anything. Now we're gonna beat this on high for three minutes. Hi, I just wanna to apologize to Rachel because we thought we had chocolate to make the dipping sauce but it appears we don't. So it'll be almond macaroons, no chocolate sauce. Sorry about that. Okay, well, what you wanna do is I'm going to take about, this is about a tablespoon worth, and I'm going to take my mixture and put it along my pan. And this pan has Silpat on it. If, for those of you who don't know, Silpat is made of silicon, and it's just a sheet that makes your pan non-stick. We're back and we're ready to take these lovely macaroons out. These have gotten nice and golden brown, and we're ready to package them for Rachel's birthday. Once they start to cool down, they'll harden up. Sorry, Rachel, if some of these are broken. This is the finished product. They're really yummy, and I'm just packaging them in this beautiful box that I got from a kit from Martha Stewart, and it's Rachel's birthday, so happy birthday, Rachel. I hope you have a nice year. I'm Olivia Austin from the ABC Cafe, and today I'm gonna be, wait, no. Okay. Hi, I'm Olivia Austin from the ABC Cafe, and today I'm gonna be, wait, no. Okay. What I'm gonna do first is, I don't know what I'm gonna do first.